Burst. Okay. Wow. I wasn't sure where Tigus was at. Okay. Good. That ain't no earthquake. That's an ultra. It's ultra lists. Oh. In my memory, he sounded more badass saying those those words. This was more like just a. He just mentioned it. Um, would really like one of your grenades. Not gonna lie. It's fine. We lost the fire bet. We did. Is that a problem? I didn't give him a name, so I don't know if it's a problem. Let's get the hell out of here. How are we safe? Like, we're literally in an underground tunnel. Got a feeling that we're kind of fucked if this were to happen, Just but. One more charge and we're gonna have ourselves a night as barbecue. Stay sharp, boys. A little bit of healing going on right there behind my camera. <laughs> Sell me. Break it down. What's up? Talk oh shit, the What's Zerk up? Chaser Force counts. No, no, no. No, I'm picking up something, but it's. Okay, this is pretty good. I lost one of the fire beds, though. I wonder if I need those for this section. Wouldn't be surprised. Get him, Betty. Time to man up. What is this toxic uh, masculinity right here, uh, Mr. Rainer Man? Time to man up. What about time to woman up? Oh, yeah, yeah. Can't believe this guy. I lost the other fire bed guy, by the way. Is this too slow? Time to man up. Oh. Um, this seems like a problem. Guys, I'm saving the mariners. They didn't make it. We're going to ignore those lads. I'm sorry. Don't see what I could do. Nice save. Thanks. Did I not save before this point? No, I did. 1804 is what the most recent save is at. Stormed them, Loco? Oh, okay, well. I guess I have to do this section again. Keep going, boys. Get him, Biddy. Maybe if you save all the bonus objective, uh, dudes, you can just barely keep it alive or something. Did I just lose two of my guys? That's not great. Um. Yeah, I'm not sure. Whatever's popping those eggs is gonna be in a world of hurt when I get a hold of them. Stepman just can't fall, can't stop falling over, man. Over 
What's up? You know, the way those eggs all hatched, it's like they were waiting for us. Did I hit them both? There's a strong likelihood that another Zerg creature was controlling them. No. Oh, God. Game over, man. Game over. I'm afraid not. What's the plan? I mean, I don't really need to keep him alive, do I? Can I not just walk over to that circle? Was that fine? Loco destroyed the rocks? Joe. Joe, are you... Joe. If we're gonna backseat game... When this thing goes off, we need to be a long way from here. Brenda! What the hell is that? It's Brenda! I heard Brenda! Oh, she's so cute. No! No, 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 no. Don't take Brenda down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Brenda hits like a truck. A very sexy looking truck. What's the plan? Talk to me. What's sound? Um seems like a problem. She's huge, WTF. She's going for more eggs. Stop the queen before she gets to him. I'm a bad man. Whatever. What's the plan? What's up? What's up? Talk to me. Okay. Um, four minutes remaining. Okay. Sell me. Guess she's gonna go over here. What's up? What's the what's up? Sell me. What's up? Sell me. Nice. I missed my by snipe. <laughs> Oh yikes! I wish I, I missed with my snipe. Okay. Did a lot of damage to Brenda though. Do I have to kill all of these eggs? I don't remember. Uh. Brenda, no! You're destroying the seismic charges. We gotta stop them. What's the plan? Ah, yikes. She blew up the explosion. Chat, I'm a StarCraft 2 lore expert. I watched three whole videos. That's it, LRS. This is actually what Protoss players think queens are like in StarCraft 2. Did you guys know that? Brenda's representation in this mission is exactly how Protoss players feel about queens. It's truly a beautiful sight. Oh, you can target with the, the little turret. I didn't know that. Okay, Brenda. Oh, she heals a little bit? Wow, Rainer got down. Why did she heal, bro? That's not fair. She heals and she stuns, yeah. Yeah, I could tell that she stunned. <laughs> Break it down. What's up? What's the plan? Talk to me. She is indeed What's stunning. <sighs> what is the point in killing these eggs, by the way? Do you think there is a point? Uh, 
I think I need to have my turret available here at the front, so. Kill a couple of a couple of things. Okay, now we go move, move back. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Did I do it? I killed Brenda, guys. Us too, if we don't get the hell out of here. Am I the bad guy? Was that the mission? For some reason, I remember struggling in this mission on Brutal back in the day. I think I've only done this mission like once, maybe twice. Oh, now I gotta run? You better run, 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 run. Hell, the lava's rising. I know like three K-pop songs, that's one of them. Now run for the extraction point, you idiot. You better run, run. Whatever it What's up? Run it to the hills. Loco is a K-pop stan, confirmed. Okay, Dear stan, I wrote you, but you still ain't calling. I left my pager and my home phone at the bottom. So a home phone for the zoomers in the ch Okay, no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna explain that. What's up? Sell me. Break it down. Talk to me. Time to man up. Raiders roll. Let's break it down. Sell me. Break it down. What's up? Sell me. Break it down. What's up? Okay. Your parents still have one. I think most parents still have a home phone just because they never bothered canceling it. That's literally the only people that have a home phone, man. People that haven't bothered canceling it. It's a great market concept. Isn't that why a whole, like half of you are subscribed to my channel as well? You just forgot, you know, to cancel and you can't be bothered to figure out how to do it. That's like half of you as well, right? Huh. Wait, you can cancel? No, 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 you can't actually. All those caves crumble. Ain't sorry to see him go. All right, guys. We sure killed a lot of them. I bet they're really scared of us now. Oh. Um, uh, of you. It's time. All right. Let's see how the boys held up while we were gone. Guys, 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 this is the final mission before the final mission. Next up, we have a mission called All In, if I'm not mistaken, which is very hard. Like normally it's already very hard. This is apparently by far the hardest mission in this campaign. According to the creator of this map, only like 0.1% of people that installed the mod completed this mission, if I understand correctly what he was trying to say. <laughs> so... <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be fun. Yeah, looking forward to that, man. How do those necklaces in those movies always come loose like that so easily? Is 
Jetzt hast du da. <lacht> das ist cool. Ja, yeah, Mega Rainer ist just really strong. Loco, have fun suffering for our entertainment. Good to see you on your feet, General. <laughs> well, we'll see how long that lasts. Dude, I brought you more dip 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 Inspector Warfield. Blip, 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 blip. Ooh, ooh. That was amazing, Warfield. There it is, boys. Assembled and well. The Zell Naga artifacts been assembled. The sacred Toblerone. What we think it does. Damn straight. Bedding our asses Built in Switzerland. Piece of crap don't sit right with me. I hear you, Tychus. But if I was banking everything on that, I'd be quit already. Cause here we are in the mouth of Is it the logo based on a Matterhorn? And we made the it mountain? this far. I don't know. Leaning on each other. <laughs> Whether it's blind luck or damn fool courage. In all my years, I've never seen anything like what you two jokers have pulled off. That thing may be the key to stopping the Queen of Blades. But it's our sweat and blood that'll make it happen. After everything we've been through, past all the fire and fury, the one thing I know is that we can count on each other to get the job done. Or die trying, if that's what it takes. I hope you realize that his mic was public the entire time, man. Before you know it, he's gonna take a piss and he forgets to unmute his- or he forgets to mute the mic, you know? It's very awkward. Because some things are just worth fighting for. There it is, boys. Sorry, I ruined it. Yeah, sorry. Sorry, I ruined it. Well, hey, if they- yeah, that's a good point. If they did affect or assemble the, the artifact in, uh, in, in Switzerland, it will probably be very well built. Right? That's kind of what Switzerland is known for, for making good shit. So maybe it being shaped after a Toblerone is not that big of a deal after all. I've shown this picture a bunch of times on stream. Uh, Reddit, what is it? Switzerland is fake. It's one of the best subreddits, by the way. So it's slash r slash Switzerland. Switzerland is fake. It's basically a subreddit where people post proof about why Switzerland is not actually real. And uh, this, this I think, is by far the best proof. They're not even creative. They copied it from a chocolate box. There it is, dude. So I don't know where the artifact got put together, but... There it is. Alright, um... Let's watch Donnie first. No, Kate. Ladies and gentlemen, this what? is a sad day for us here at UNN. I regret to inform you that last night Donny Vermillion had himself committed to the Dominion Mental Health Center here on Corval. While the nature of his abrupt mental breakdown remains unknown, we do know that he was clad only in his socks and rumored to be in possession of Emperor Mengsk's manifesto and a pound of peanut butter. We wish you all the Who best. Who the fuck counts Donnie peanut butter in pounds? Speedy recovery. In That's meantime, what bothered me about this cutscene. I've heard this one about a dozen end, times. Who counts Woo! peanut butter in pounds? Yeah! Who does that? Everyone does? Really? You go to the store and you're like, can I have three pounds of peanut butter, please? Is that a thing you do? No. What? No, not in kilograms either. We buy them in jars. You buy, like, when you when you say you buy a pound, I, I imagine it comes in, like, uh, like I don't know. Like in a bag or something, you know, like how Canadians buy milk in a bag? I, I, that's what I imagine when you say a pound of peanut butter. <laughs> barrel? You buy a barrel of peanut butter usually? Yeah, it comes in like a jar. Jars are measured in pounds? No. <laughs> we have very small and very large jars over here, man. There's no way. How many jars of water do I drink in a day? About 12 pounds. 
You bought a kilogram of peanut butter? My god. That's a lot of peanut butter. <laughs> that, that's a lot of peanut butter, man. It's empty now? Really? I am honestly not much of a peanut butter kind of guy. No, I, I don't really... You know, like, the taste of peanut butter is pretty good. And I understand that this is a proper first world problem, but I hate how it gets stuck on your, like, you know, in your jaws. Like, it just gets stuck here. I don't know. I don't like it, man. You eat it by the spoonful? Yeah, I know a lot of people do. I love peanut butter, Loco. It took you two months to finish a kilo jar of peanut butter? You eat 750 grams of peanut butter in one sitting. Mate, have you ever looked at the calorie label on a fucking jar of peanut butter? <laughs> peanut butter is, is extremely dense. If you eat... <laughs> if you eat a pound and a half of peanut butter in a sitting, that is a lot. Anyway. Um, I don't think I can do that. Guys, um... The reason why I'm not talking about the mission is because I'm a little bit concerned for this mission. It seems my faith in your abilities has been vindicated, Commander Raynor. Now the final blow must be struck. Use the artifact to neutralize the Queen of Blades and bring this bloodshed to an end. Alright, so here's the thing. All in. Apparently by far the hardest mission in this entire playthrough. The problem is that this is like the culmination of everything that's led up to this point. So in this campaign, you do not get to choose which upgrades you choose, like you pick and then change them after the fact, right? Like you have to choose permanent upgrades. Meaning that all of the choices that I've made for my mercenaries that I've hired, as well as the upgrade for the units, as well as like the, uh, what's it called? Like the um, upgrades inside of the laboratory and stuff. All of that is done and permanent. There's no additional things that I can change right now. I don't know if I've picked the right, ch like, choices or if I've made the right choices. I don't know if I did all the things in the correct way. I've decided to focus primarily on Terran Mech. But I don't even know if that's the correct thing to do. Sounds pretty noob to me, Loco. Okay, so just because I was curious, I checked out, like, three minutes of Giant Grant's game. Final mission, right? So guess what he did in his final mission? He played Bio. He chose the Side Disruptor rather than the Hive Mind Emulator. And he went Mass Bunker with Mass Ghost. I haven't even upgraded my bunkers to the max. <laughs> hmm. I'm a little bit concerned that I'm gonna do this mission, and I'll find out that it's basically not possible with the choices that I've made. I have done a very different playthrough. So from what I understand, the reason why ghosts and bunkers are so good is because ghosts inside of bunkers can kill the brute lords and actually, you know, reach them. Because one of the problems you run into is that ghosts usually can't actually reach the, the you know... The brutes. New subscriber detected. I did get one of the two upgrades for the bunker. I think I can put two ghosts in each bunker if I want to, but that's really about it. I will also be able to steal brute lords, and I will also be able to like steal um, with the hive mind emulator ultralisks and all that. But I've got a feeling that this is gonna be kind of difficult. Well. Thank you, Tara Dani, or Tara Dani, for the support. Welcome back. So there is a chance that this mission with my choices that I've made is quite literally not possible. I don't know. Loco, you can always just restart and make the right choices. Yeah, yeah, that, that technically... Uh, could, yeah. The engineer core is moving the Zell Naga artifact to the base of the primary hive cluster. I could do that. We'll entrench the last of our defenses all around it. Unfortunately, it's going to take some time to charge up the device for a strike against the Queen of Blades. 
Intel provided by the Mobius Foundation suggests that the Zerg will be attracted by the artifact's pulse emanation. Oh, he went also mass battle cruiser. I don't have battle cruiser upgrades either. Zerg will go into a frenzy trying to reach it. There's no way we can beat a sustained Zerg attack with what we got left. The artifact itself. We're gonna go attack. tank Viking Benshi Intel, and go. They can discharge what they're calling an energy nova that should kill any Zerg within its radius. I did not pick up battle cruiser upgrades. Whoa. No. It takes time to recharge after each They are very expensive. Otherwise, this would be easy. You'll have to activate the energy nova manually. Fortunately, it pulses on a subsonic frequency, so we'll be immune to its effects. Hey, Pyro Waffle. Recharge or no? Thank I'll you for placing an order in a merch store, General. Remember, Kerrigan's still out there waiting for us. How could we forget? What's your choice for anti air loco? Vikings. And ghosts. There she is, out of the Zerk butthole. I mean, uh. You've brought me the Zelnaga. Night is worm thing. It was good of you to save me the trouble of finding it for myself. Morning, large Zerg force. Use Nova, sir! Sir, use the Nova. Ah, uh, no, I think we're good, drone. Defense. But new subscriber detected. Thank you, Bunny Warren. My forces are without number, and yours are dwindling by the minute. This can only end one way. Huh? Probably right, actually. Oh god! Dude, I got so many SCVs, what the fuck? Okay, we'll start with some of those. I will also make another one of these. We'll get upgrades going, actually I'll go for that one first. Uh... Okay. You guys pop in these bunkers, I suppose. You guys get over there in that bunker. Okay. New subscriber detected. So I think I'm gonna set up a round of bunkers over here. Because that's what Grant did, and Grant seems like a smart guy. When I grow up, I wanna be Grant. I think that would be Grant. <laughs> Sorry. Alright. Um I'm gonna go ahead and make a ghost thing. I'm gonna go ahead and start up. I'm sorry. No, that was bad. That was Oh yeah, by the way, since so apparently there's like a couple of changes that they made to the mission. First off, it doesn't matter if you choose to take out the ground units or the air units. You're going to go up against Nidus and Flyers regardless in this final mission. And if I understand correctly, the Nidus Worms, the longer that they are alive for, the more units they will actually spawn. That sounds fun. I don't know if I need both of those upgrades, to be honest. That might not necessarily be the best choice, but... I will make a lot of extra SCVs as well, just for base repair and all that. I think that would be good. Okay. Making some ghosts. I'm gonna go out and make some extra bunkers over here, too. These bunkers are, by the way, really good. Okay. So I need to have like a hotkey for my, yeah, yeah, for my chosen units that I want to defend with. Ghost reporting. Okay. Okay, guys. First ten percent done. Easy. Not even close. I mean, 9.9%, .9%, but I mean, that's basically success, okay? Need to get those additional upgrades. Base. 
We'll have to make a decision to add on additional units here in the back as well at some point. And like start up missile turrets for the back area of our base, but I think this is okay for now. Okay. Uh, let's keep on upgrading. Oh wow. Can't afford anything. Don't have a lot of gas. I'm prioritizing the mech upgrades. Okay, left side seems to be okay. Left side in general is always in a little bit more trouble than the right, usually. I'll go ahead and get some uh, some cheaper units too. Um, I decided to upgrade some vultures, so we'll make some of those. I don't need like a gajillion siege tank either though. Okay, so this is, I think, when the first Nidus Worms spawn, right? I think initially it's Nidus Worms first. Oh, I'm forgetting about the Hive Mind emulators. You're right. Maybe I shouldn't have gone double. Um... Okay, that's good. Heads up, sir. I'm detecting a large group of Zerg flyers heading straight for the artifact. Okay. I'll activate my Nova for that. Should be good. Um, Hive Mind emulator is awesome, but also expensive. Okay. You guys sniped that? Oh wow. Okay, these are a little bit different of a type of snipe than what I'm usually seeing in a game of StarCraft, but fair enough. Additional supply depots required. Okay. Hive mind emulators are actually super important. Okay, putting down some static defense in the back of my base too, because I know there's gonna be units coming in from that angle. Okay, good. These are all very good spawns for me. Sir, we're tracking a large number of Zerg flyers coming your way. Adding on my Hive Mind emulators right now, so we can hopefully steal some of those units. I definitely need a lot more Banshees, though. Because I don't think otherwise I'm going to be in that good of a spot. Okay. Supernova. Almost available again. I think she gets her specialized ability at the third run, right? At the third thing. She gets like a big AoE type of thing very soon. Okay. This one's super easy. That one's kind of far away. Lots of Zerg flyers on their way to you, sir. Okay, that one's far away. You'll regret that. Uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and use the Nova. Keep it up. Oh, that actually kills one of the Nidus worms. Interestingly enough. Base is under attack. 
Abandon ship! Okay. Insufficient Vespine gas base is under attack. How about lending a hand? God, these things are really quite tanky, aren't they? I really need the armor upgrades, though. The armor upgrades are super important. Warning. Seismic disturbance detected. Nidus 1 inbound. More Zerg flyers inbound. They're coming in behind you. Watch out. Okay. Got taken care of those, or I took care of those in the back pretty easily. Nova is not going to be available for this next section. Okay. Our SCVs are under attack. It's a lot of units everywhere, though. Sir, I'm picking up a mass of overlords heading your way. Oh, yikes. What happened over here? <laughs> could I actually... Oh, maybe I could have taken control of that one instead. That probably would have been a better choice. God, that's a lot. The artifact's energy nova is fully recharged. Activating nova. Base is under attack. Insufficient Vespi. Um, gonna cancel the brew. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna get some more attack upgrades and stuff instead. Base. Class twelve psionic waveform detected. Okay. The blades has returned. Scour you all from my. Is under attack. Not too keen with how this is going on the left side of the screen, but Ghost reporting. So you should have that storm thing available right now, by the way, which I got to be very careful about. Seismic disturbance detected. Nidus one inbound. Does she not have it? Lots of Zerg flyers on their way to you, sir. Kerrigan's gone underground. Pour it on, troops. Okay. Brute Lord. Okay. I think we're okay at this point so far, right? Things are going quite well. I'm gonna just start planting down a whole lot of these things because I have a gajillion minerals. Sir, we're tracking a large number of Zerg flyers coming your way. Okay. 
What's the better cruiser there? Can we use it? Sir, we should activate the artifacts Nova. I think I'm gonna wait. I have a brute lurk. I have two brute lurks. This fucker is still going to town? Didn't I send someone over there? I could have sworn I sent someone over there. Okay, I'm leaving two Vikings in the back because for some reason. You fools should never have come here. Okay. Gonna save again. Your forces are under attack. Okay. I have Nova. Oh, she used the storm Sir, thing again. We're tracking a large number of Zerg flyers coming your way. She's retreated again. Hold the line. I think I just lost a whole lot of Benchies somehow. Base is under attack. Receiving. Engaging. Yes. <laughs> Our SCVs are under attack. Base Mayday. is under Mayday. attack. Okay. There she is again. 69% right now. Going pretty nice so far. Sir, scanners show the largest Zerg bio signature I've ever seen. And it's headed your way. Oh no. Big dig Zerg flyers over here. Oh shit. I forgot about the Leviathan. Oh, that might be a problem. I'm kind of out of money, guys, because I got destroyed by the amount of Vikings in this game. Oh god. I don't think I have enough uh, to deal with that Leviathan, do I? That's a real problem. What do you do against Leviathan? I have a Hydra. Um, I think I don't have enough against the Leviathan. That Leviathan deals a fuck ton of damage, and as long as it's up, it deals a ton. I don't think I build enough things in order to counter it. For some reason, sometimes the Mutas don't die. Insufficient rescue gas. 
Yeah, I'm not sure exactly what my best bet against um, the Leviathan is. So we're pretty good, but I need to kill that Leviathan because without it, there's no way I can win. Um, no, you can't mind control that thing. Mm. I forgot about the Leviathan, so I never build enough um, flyers. Leviathan appears at 69%. Not so nice after all, guys. <laughs> Why don't you take control of Mutas? Because Mutas are ass. Okay, I queued up a couple more Vikings. And with a couple, I mean a lot. Tracking a large number of Zerg flyers coming your way. Base is under attack. Roger that. Is Base is under attack. Base is under attack. Can I reach that? No, I actually didn't build this thing close enough. I should have built it closer to the edge. Would have been good. Oh, yikes. Didn't realize that my left side was falling like that. Um, Probably should go further back, to be honest. I was actually concerned mostly for the left side in this mission, but... Gonna move a couple of tanks over there. Right, so this is where I ended up losing a lot of my troops earlier. Because I got memed. Like, this is where she double stormed. Like, basically, she stormed my bunker units once, and then after she did that storm, nearly when she was dead, she decided to storm my my flyers as well, which was a big issue. Okay, there's the one storm. She might do it again right here on the left. Yep, there it is. Lots of Zerg flyers on their way to you, sir. New subscriber detected. Hold the line. Nine months. Kill Kerrigan logo. I'm trying. Base is under attack. Your forces are under attack. Thank you very much for the support. Okay, let's have you guys go over there. Okay, so we know that the thing is gonna spawn soon, right? 69% apparently. Do I have enough? I have a lot. Sir, scanners show the largest Zerg biosignature I've ever seen. And it's headed your way. Warning. Loco, you're not maxed out. You're correct. Well, well spotted. We can max out in a heartbeat, though, if you want to. 
but that's not the point. Okay, let's see how this goes. Uh, did I lose all my benchies somehow? Oh no, I was gonna say. That'd be bad. <laughs> okay. Got an ultra? Ooh, that's gonna be a tricky one. Lots of Zerg flyers on their way to you, sir. I lost most of my uh, static defense in that area. Need to split you guys up. Half of you go over there, please. I don't have enough gas. It's a real issue. You mother fools. <laughs> Always sounds like that's what she's saying, anyways. You bunch of mother fools! <laughs> There's the storm. 